yeah so um just a quick thing on how to make people have been asking me how to make your clips really smooth um and yeah it's a quick guide on how to do that this is in uh premiere bro although i'm fairly sure it does work in vegas and um other editing software um but yeah so basically how to do this will make a big difference in your clips is um all you have to do is um first go to sequence sequence settings and put it down from whatever it is just a 60 fps for now like this um it would, like just trust me it'll make a big difference in the end um it'll help you might not think so but yeah um so then now once you've done that just go to the clip you want to make really smooth and hit time interpolation and or right click on it go to time interpolation and frame blending see this will do that and then your i'd recommend before you actually like you rent like fully export it uh like here i'd recommend just like clicking on it going to sequence and then render selection and uh, just waiting for that to render that's just finished rendering you can see there's a green line here and now if you play back it'll look smooth and all that and um that this is just the preview so all you want to do is you want to go to the clip and hit o and now make this so that that's what you want that's what it will render and then um to to, quick, to quickly export the shortcut is um control m or command m if you're on mac um and you just go to wherever you want to export it i'll just export it here just name it whatever you want to do whatever you want to name it um also render settings um for the format you want to render in h265 not h264 so the he vc one um and then you want to uncheck that and put it to whatever you want to render it i'm just going to render it at 300 fps that's what i normally do and um make sure hardware encoding is on not software encoding otherwise it will use your cpu rather than your gpu and uh, you want to go down to the bitrate settings change the bitrate encoding from vbr one pass to a cbr then drag it all the way up and put the higher the quality to highest and you want to tick this the maximum render quality and um and put the time interpolation to frame blending here and then you can just export that and yeah i'll come back to you when that uh that's finished exporting so that's just finished rendering or exporting um yeah that's 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 really it for um, what you want to do and you can do that for have however many like things as you want i'm just again do that and frame blending and remember to have the sequence settings put on 60 fps now i'm going to show you like a comparison between the two like without um before or after like what you do what um, i did in this video so yeah